Uh, we have recently witnessed, uh, as you know, unprecedented attacks on journalists and journalism, uh, whether it's a violence overseas, uh, recently learning, losing, uh, sadly, uh, members of the press uh, just in the last month in Ukraine, or threats and intimidation at home. Um, this is very concerning to me, uh, given the important role of the First Amendment. My dad uh, was a newspaper reporter, uh, so the issues hit home for me. Uh, can you talk about your view of the role of journalists in our democracy? Thank you, Senator. Journalists, uh, freedom of the press is protected by our, the First Amendment. It is uh, about the dissemination of information, which is necessary for um, a democratic form of government. The Supreme Court has held as much, and that was uh, the basis for the court's uh, determinations in protecting uh, the press from liability in, in New York Times versus Sullivan and, and its prog progeny. Okay. Um, as you know, that uh, ruling was a unanimous ruling in support of the First Amendment, and the court held uh, that when newspapers report on public officials, they're only liable for untrue statements that are published with knowledge or reckless disregard for whether the statement was false. Uh, the court in Sullivan based its decision on our country's, quote, profound national commitment to the principle that debate on public issues should be uninhibited, robust, and wide open. Uh, that's their quote. And it recognized that, quote, erroneous statement is inevitable in free debate, end quote, end quote, must be protected if the freedoms of expression are to have the breathing space that they need to survive. Um, do you agree that those principles are just as relevant today as they were when the Supreme Court first decided uh, New York Times v. Sullivan? New York Times v. Sullivan is the a continuing binding precedent of the Supreme Court. And it does state the principles that the court has determined are uh, undergirding uh, the First Amendment right to um, free press. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.